Saturday, July 23rd, and we are starting the day off strong with a nice fat red. I have moved my way. Um, I'm starting off as far up the creek as I can possibly go without crossing property lines. And my goal is I'm just going to ease my way back towards the house. So last time, I kind of did it out and back, and I felt like I was trying to cover too much ground, and I was moving way too much, way too fast. And so starting this way, um, starting this far up, and just working my way back, hopefully it'll, you know, force me to slow down and maybe um, lead to a little bit more success. So I've seen a few moving in this area. So I'm going to put this away and see if we can't close the distance on a couple more. Okay, it's not often a plan works out perfectly, but this one really did. So I had just shot that first red this morning, and I'd be curious to know what other people have experienced, but for me, typically when I shoot a squirrel, it gets really dead for a while. I mean, like, there's no movement for a long time, and so I'll typically move down the line um, to a new area that I haven't blown out yet. Well, that's exactly what I did. I went down the creek and sat down on a stump. And I didn't see anything, could not, like, there was no activity around me, but I could hear chatter back up the way I came. And so I thought, well, before I continue on, I might as well just slip back up there and just take a peek. And I had just gotten back to the tree I was standing at when I first saw that first red. And not, like, five seconds later, this guy uh, scrambled up the tree in front of me. So that just worked out perfectly. We'll see if we can't make it happen again. <laughs> So as I crept down the creek, I found this little spot that I, I just assumed would be perfect. White oak trees around, I found a walnut, some big sycamores, lots of shade, good breeze flowing through. There's some deep pockets in the creek close by, so I thought, man, this has got to be the spot that the squirrels are gravitating to in the summer when it gets really hot. I sat for a while, didn't see anything, didn't hear anything, just about to give up when he just popped up 20 yards away running up a tree. And I, I didn't get the lid cam going, but I, I just barely got the tactic cam running before I took that shot. So at least we got some of it on video. But I tell you what, this is the real prize, number three for the day. So this will make a good mess. Thank you. 